Oh, well, hello there again, friend and family. So good to see you again. And as you can see, we're in Alice. And you might wonder what we're doing. But before I tell you, jump on in, buckle up, keep your hands to yourself, no fighting and bickering. Okay? So yeah, it's Friday. So you know what that means. It's time for another exciting episode of Fast Food Friday. And if you're new to the channel and don't understand, this video, like the videos in the past of Fast Food Friday, are sponsored by some of you through your donations and through the super thanks. And I just want to say thank you for making sure not only I, but the kitty crew get a treat. So yeah, we're off. And we're going to be buying something special that always comes to mind during this time of season. Yeah, because it's Lent, which always reminds me of the wisdom of eating more fish. Something I should remember throughout the year. So hey, let's go. And let me show you what we're going to be getting as a treat because of all of you. So here we go, heading out of the neighborhood, and it's a fine day. Oh, it's about 69 with a partly cloudy sky. I would say more sunny than cloudy, wouldn't you? It's a beautiful day in our neighborhood, and I hope it's a beautiful day wherever you may be in your neighborhood too. But yeah, this is a special edition. A fast food Friday. Some may say it's the fish edition. And there's a couple of things I want to pick up. One of which is available all year round and one of which only comes during the season of Lent. But you'll get to see them both. And we'll review them and show them to you in great detail once we get back to our little country kitchen as we usually do, to make it maybe a little bit educational, fun, and entertaining too. But did you just notice gas here has rose in price? Who knew? Yep, it's 305 a gallon. Maybe you'll let me know wherever you are in the US of A or in other countries too, what your gas or diesel is costing you. But hey, we'll chat a little bit more as we get a little bit closer. So you don't got to sit here and listen to the old man ramble on as we ride along. It won't take long. Well, we're starting to get close to our first stop. Can you guess where it's going to be at? Well, we're stopping here for two reasons. Yep, there it is, the Golden Arches, McDonald's. One is because Cleo requested, she wanted the Chicken McNuggets this time, and it was her time to pick. So yep, we gotta get them too. But while we're here, we're gonna get something that once or twice a year, since it's available now all year long and has been for quite some time, yeah. And that is, can you guess, the iconic and classic McDonald's filet fish Hi, are you a rewards member? No. Yes, sir. Please provide me with your rewards code. Yes, I'd like a 20-piece chicken McNuggets with the hot mustard sauce and one filet of fish And that'll be all. We took the sauce on our new McDonald's sauce as well. Do what? We have some new, like a sweet chili taste sauce. It's really good. I could kind of throw like one in there so you try it out. Drop mustard. Okay, we'll go with that. All right, and what's your, you was it drink again you asked for? I'm sorry. It was just a filet of fish, no drink. Filet of fish, I'm sorry. All right, would that be all for you today? Yes, ma'am. All right, it's going to be twelve ninety six. Okay, thank you, ma'am. You're welcome. I need a receipt, too. So what, sir? I need a receipt when I get there. Yes, sir. Thank you, ma'am. So there you have it. We got it all ordered up. Cleo's Chicken McNuggets for the kitty crew, and of course, my filet fish There you go, ma'am. 
Appreciate you. You're welcome. So, the filet of fish was $4.19. That's just for the sandwich. But you know, if you know, and maybe you don't, let me know in the comments below. Is there a time when you crave a filet of fish Just not during Lent, but other times of the year. Because I know I do for whatever reason. All right. All right. Thank you, ma'am. Have a good day. Enjoy the sunshine. I am. You too. <laughs> Woo, and there, we got it off. But we got one more stop to make. Because like I say, there's something new that just came out this year and i bet you can guess where we're going to it's just right up here up the road you'll probably start to see it sign in just a second or two and i'm dying to try it or at least scope it out and give it an honest review because i've ate the filet of fish over the years a many a many a time Yep, you knew it. It was going to be Jack's. Woo, yeah. They got the big and crispy fish sandwich. So you know, we got to check it out. They also got a new item menu, too. They brought back their wraps. Woo, baby. Who knew? But we ain't getting a wrap today. Though they look tasty. Right there, Jack. Yeah, I'd like one of them big and crispy fish sandwiches. You want the fish and fry combo? No, ma'am, just just the sandwich. Be fine. Anything else? Nope, that'll be it. I see it that one down Thank you, ma'am. That was quick. And in front of us, we got one of our fine firefighters. We should all thank them for their service and risking their lives. And hey, if you want to, let me know in the comments below the video if you bought a filet of fish in your area, not just gone on the internet and checked the price because that's not cool. Because as some of my friends have found out, what the internet says and what the reality of the restaurant charges is a whole different ball game too. But if you bought one, tell me what the price is in your neighborhood. It was $4.19 in mine. She didn't say what the jacks would be. But it looks jam up. We're about to see. How you doing? $4.94? Okay, there you go, ma'am. Well, I gave you too much. I thought it'd be more. Thank you so much, ma'am. Mm -hmm. So now we got both. We got the classic, the iconic McDonald's filet of fish, and we got the Jacks. Big and crispy fish sandwich. Woo! And I can tell you, maybe y'all know who are riding along, the smell in this car is amazing. But we gotta get out, and there's starting to be a little traffic, because it's getting close to the schools getting out. But hey, we'll just ride along and chat a minute if you want to in private. And I won't bore you with the return trip. We've all seen it a hundred times. And I'm sure, you know, if y'all want to take a ride around my little town and the rural areas again, you just let me know. And then when I go, which ain't all too often because of the price of gas, but there are times when even I got to get out of the house and jump in Alice and she wants to go. And since she's so thrifty on gas, it never costs much. It's about the cheapest entertainment you can get these days. It's not like I'm dragging my little butt around in no SUV. <laughs> So hey, we'll see you when we get back to the house. Well, as you can see, friends and family, I got both of these 
fine, delicious fish sandwiches laid out. And we're going to look here at the McDonald's classic, the iconic filet fish right here. Just as it came out of the box. It's a little bit sideways, sort of a little bit wompy there, but that's okay. And here's my receipt, in case you wanted to know. And it cost $4.19. Of course, we got the 20-piece McNuggets for the Kitty Crew for $7.59, which they've come down. They used to be $8.59. So I guess McDonald's is trying to lower prices to meet us poor folks' needs. They've been getting a lot of crap. But let's take a look at the McDonald's iconic filet of fish and see what it's all about. Yep, we'll take off this little bun. And you can see there's a generous amount of tartar sauce. And there's the deep fat fried and breaded wild caught Alaskan pollock fish patty. Yep, that's what they use, pollock. Wild caught from Alaska, they say. And if you look closely, there, there is a half a slice of cheese. Let's turn it around so you can see it better. Yep, you can see it better right there. They only put a half a slice of cheese. They didn't shrink the cheese. And you can verify that on YouTube by watching people who work at McDonald's make these sandwiches up right in front of you. So there you have that. Now, let's get over here and take a look at Jack's. This is their new big and crispy fish sandwich right here on a potato brioche bun. Imagine that. And look at the size of this fish filet. And you might want to know, is it wild caught Alaskan pollock? Oh no. It is cod. Wild caught. North Atlantic cod. Yeah, it is. And I love cod. And is it is good and better for you than the Alaska pollock? Well, I don't know. But if I had to guess, I can prefer the cod. And let's take a look under its bun and see what it's got going on. And you can see it's got plenty of shredded lettuce four pickles, now there ain't no cheese, and some of their special homemade tartar sauce. Yeah. But let's do another thing to see what value we got. Because the Jack's Big and Crispy Fish Sandwich costs a little more, 30 cents, for $4.49. And we got the scale right here. And we're using the same paper plate. So we're just going to turn it on. Any slight differences in the paper plate, I don't think will count. So let's place the McDonald's filet of fish on there. And see what it's all about. And it comes to five ounces. Yep. So, there you have it. Five ounces. Of a play of fish goodness. Well, what about the jacks? Ooh, I can already tell picking it up. It might be a little bit more. Well, jacks, you get 7.5 ounces of goodness right there. Yep, I hope you can see that. So, yeah, it may cost 30 cents more, but you're getting 50% more sandwich. A bigger bun, a fancier bun. I mean, it's potato brioche bun. The only thing I can think that would make it even the more better is a slice of American cheese. So there you have it. There's the Jacks. There's the McDonald's, side by side. Now, in the comments below the video, let me know. Which one you would choose. And which one you think is the better value too. Now I know all of you don't have a Jacks near you. And yeah. Maybe you wish you had. Because I know I sure do. And yep. Of course McDonald's comes in a little box. And Jacks 
comes wrapped in a foil wrap to keep it all warm and juicy for you. So, that's it. We're going to enjoy, right now, the jacks. And we're going to save the filet of fish for tomorrow's lunch, too. So nothing goes to waste. And let me know, like I say in the comments, which one you would choose. And if you bought one or the other, let me know your thoughts on that, as well as the price of your filet of fish or even your Jack's Big and Crispy Fish Sandwich in your neighborhoods. Woo, I can't wait. I'm going to be enjoying me some fish. Oh, there you are, friend and family. Well, there you have it. That's the facts on the two options I have for fast food, fish sandwiches, in my neighborhood. Let me know what your favorites are. Maybe you got a Wendy's or some other restaurant you go to when you're craving your fast food fish sandwich. And hey, stay tuned towards the end to see this kitty crew eat up their nuggets too as a special treat. And as always, thank you for treating us here in Mr. Tom's neighborhood. Gracie, 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 you want these? Come on, you want them? Come on. You want your, oh, there you go, Gracie. Come here. Check them out. Yep, I know. You're not really into strange people food, are you? Yep. Take a bite. I don't even know, remember if you've had chicken nuggets before. Mm, you don't know, do you? Gracie's sort of... Uh, I guess strange. Well, it looks like she's going to eat them. She had to sniff them. Taste a few. And now she's getting the job done. Yep. Of course, we got to clean up around her food station tomorrow. Yep, she's got to get one out like Trix used to. <laughs> and kill it in the floor. Yep. Some kitties are a mess. Well, it looks like Gracie's happy with her fast food Friday treat. And of course, she thanks you. Now, let's go see what the kitty crew thinks of theirs. Hey guys, what do you want? Huh? What, Cleo? Yep, yep, you decided. So we got your treat. What do you say, Speedy? <laughs> what, Spooky? Cleo! <laughs> spooky. You gotta check them out too? <laughs> Come on, guys. We'll put them out here. So we can, yeah. We'll just take them down the steps and put them down here, okay? Come on now. Get out from under my feet. <laughs> If I can't get through y'all, I can't get them on the ground. Come on. Here we go. Woo, look at there. They're ready to go. Yes, they are. And they're going to make fast work of them, I think. Well, as you can see, the kitty crew's happy with their fast food Friday treat too. Of course, Cleo, she come over here to thank me and give me some love. Yeah, Cleo, you got to pick. You better get over there eating. You just want some loving? Oh, <laughs> you loving on Papa's shoes? Yep. Well, you better get over there and get some of them nuggets. She just wanted to come over and say thank you. Brush on my feet. And of course, she was thanking all of you. And that's what Fast Food Friday is all about. It's because of all of you who choose, and I know some can't, to fund our treats every so often. For the kitty crew, and for me too.
and I try to make it entertaining. Maybe a little bit educational and informative too. And I'll tell you what, I saved the filet of fish for tomorrow's lunch and I chose to try the Big and Crispy fish sandwich from Jack's. And I've always enjoyed the filet of fish but I'm going to tell you what, there's a new boss in town and that's definitely Jack's got a winner there. Woo! That cod, it was battered with seasoned batter and it was really good. Speedy, don't get nervous about the doggies. Papa will sit out here. Yep. We got doggies roaming the neighborhood and the kitties get real leery of them, especially Speedy. If you've been with the channel a long, long time, you'll know why she's called Speedy. Because when anything comes around that might be a threat or a perceived one with them, yep, she can move really fast. Also, when she hears the word bet. So, yep. Speedy, if you don't quit worrying about the doggy and come on back, Cleo and Spooky have ate them all. Because you can see they're not stopping. They love their McNuggets. And it's one of Cleo's favorites. Because she's the one that requested it and she's coming back to thank Papa. And thank all of you. You thanking your friends and family and fans, Cleo? You are. Woo! Sun's getting low. And it's starting to get chilly. Well, so I'm not a distraction. Taking them away from their tree. We're going to have to run on inside before we start shaking like a leaf. So there you have it, friends and family. I hope you found that enjoyable. And maybe a little educational and informative too. And once again, I can't thank you all enough for making it come true for all of us here. In our little neighborhood. And I hope you can still treat yourself from time to time. But until I, Spooky, Cleo, Speedy, sometimes he's Cliff, little fluffy muffin, and of course the princess of the house, Gracie. See you on that next episode. Y'all take care, stay safe, and may God bless you all, because we love you too. Goodbye for now. Ooh, guys, I got to get on in. Cleo, I got to get on in. It's getting chilly with that sun getting low, okay? So let's head her on in. Yeah, my belly's full too. So it's time to think about editing a video. And hey, maybe we can take a nap later all.